It's not easy to score a goal, from the park to the professional pitch. But Winchester City's Warren Bentley doesn't have that problem, having scored 46 goals in all competitions so far this season. It's a familiar sight to Winchester City fans seeing Bentley score goals week in, week out. The number 10 is clearly playing at the top of his game, but how does he do it? According to the man himself, his teammates give him a bit of a helping hand. Well, it helps with the team I'm playing in. Uh, we get loads of attacking op options throughout the game, chances galore really. I should have scored a lot more to be honest. We have a, a lot of decent players inside, so I'm not, not just the only man teams are picking up, but um, obviously you do get a bit more attention as a striker from the defenders, but you just have to deal with it, I'm used to it now. Bensley re-signed for City at the beginning of the season from Orsford Town after initially struggling to make an impact to the club as a youngster. But last season, he scored a career-best 58 goals, which means in just two seasons, he has scored over 100 goals in all competitions. Talk about making an impact now. It's obviously the best feeling when you're playing football. Um, and nothing like scoring in front of a packed out den plan on Friday night. It's something I do in my spare time outside of work that I, I want to do. It's uh, a pastime that I've always enjoyed since I was young. Warren Bensley is clearly a talented individual, but how much of that is down to confidence and self-belief? I've sought out an expert to answer that question. So, I mean, fundamentally, um, sports performance is, is about psychology. So you can have. And at the elite level, they talk about the fact that you can physically and technically and tactically get to a similar level. But obviously, the thing that differentiates whether you're successful or not is the stuff that's going on in your head. It's one of the reasons why less talented individuals can beat more talented individuals. So it's obviously very effective at putting the ball in the back of the net. So he must have the skills. But also, it comes down to confidence. He's obviously very confident because he's been performing well, but there must be other sources of confidence for him as well. So knowing he's prepared, well done, the same things that he usually does. People telling him that he's improving as a player, that's important. So there must be a range of factors which are contributing to him going out on a Saturday or Wednesday or whenever they're playing and walking out on that pitch thinking, how many goals am I going to score rather than if I'm going to score? I would like to play higher, there's no secret about that and we, we've had that discussion, I'm sure most of the team would like to play higher. And we've played against a few conference south sides this year and the, the, the club's done itself no harm in any of those games. I think I've done well and proven to myself more than anyone that I can play at that standard. It's whether the club can progress at the same rate as, as, as myself and I think it can match my ambition. Bensley is a full-time PE teacher, a job which he loves, but not as much as his love for football. Both are uh, something I really enjoy. Um, teaching, there's nothing better than teaching a good lesson and the kids really enjoying what you're, what you're teaching them and what they're learning. But obviously I'd rather score a last minute winner on a, on a Saturday with, with the team. So what does the future hold for Warren Bentley? And can he break into football at a reasonably high level? I'm not sure. I don't really like to set myself any long-term targets. Um, what I learned from last summer is just to take, take each decision as it comes, really. And that decision is not made at the moment, and I don't really like to make that decision during the season. Probably the standard I, was, I would be able to get at, if it was professional standard, would be at low echelons. Um, which would obviously be absolutely great. I mean, everyone dreams of being a professional footballer when they're younger. But I um, also, also have uh, ambitions with, with my work and being able to fit work and football together can sometimes be a better balance. But you never know. I mean, like I said, it's something, something every, every kid dreams of when they're younger. So you never know. Warren Bentley loves playing for Winchester City, but his ability and prolificness in front of goal wouldn't look out of place in a higher conference league or maybe even the football league. If he keeps up his current form and impressive goal scoring tally, that break into a high level of football may not be so far away. Ross Perkins, Winchester News Online.